Hi, I'm KM Lo. I'm a filmmaker, technomat, trainer. I think I'm a teen teen without snowy, refugee of the world, living an alternative life. So I make films about homeless in Japan, neighboring refugees, airport lodger. Now, I want to start a new adventure. Hi, it seems I'm in Africa, but actually I'm in China. I'm in Chocolate City, an African ghetto in Guangzhou. It is more than 20,000 Africans living here, mostly are trading with Chinese suppliers. They are very shy to camera, some really mean it, because many are illegal stayers doing odd jobs for fellow traders. I go to a shopping mall in Selby, talk to a supplier, trade with the Africans. Lady 没有没有到到现在来讲只是说偶尔欠钱可能欠最多一个礼拜就会给 approach a rapper he invites me to make a music video 這個對我都男人呢,這個就是他們的Disney呢,那些美女呢,在那裡的,那個就是直頭sex so what's the name of this village? This village is uh, Denfen, Denfen Chun. Roberto shows me this multicultural wonderland. There's no other place like this village in the whole country at this moment that, you know, that gets so many people from so many different countries getting in touch with people from many different parts of China. Lamian restaurants stopped doing Lamian and then now they're just baking or grilling fish for Africans. This is truly the most inclusive and diverse global village in China. They're happily embracing multiculture, new culture, subculture here, whatever you say. Most Africans are desperately seeking their wives. This will help them to extend their visa. Only 500 African men are the lucky ones. They managed to get a Chinese wife. I found a jewelry trader who married a local. by people is easy. But yeah. how you convince your wife to accept you in the first place? When you live a life that makes people to accept you, they will definitely accept you. So how many dumplings you ate? <laughs> <laughs> a lot. Sunday, I filmed some chocolate kids near the church. Beneath their smiling faces, some facing serious difficulties. Some of the African fathers were deported and banned to return. Their father personally have sent back to their country. I tried to get across so many who have this kind of problem to come and face the camera to say, but they are feel so shy to express themselves. But not only African, yes, yes, you know, but the foreigner in this land, you know, one way or the other, they get deported. So the, how this child grow? How to uh, bring some uh, parents yeah. back in order? Because it's becoming too difficult and worse that so many single parents are right here in China. So I really think the government should do something about it. Sure. So what is your dream? My dream is to create and to participate in the for the good of uh, mankind. <laughs>
是因他没有分开每种意思。